You in the future. You see Isabel. Latina mama. You the so-called a-hole. You knock this girl up, cool. You you bust up in the club, bit. No rubber, none of that. You just let her go? Like, you was trying to keep this? Okay, okay, bet. So, women are empowered. Women can do whatever they want with their own bodies, all right? She takes a whole trip with the, the crew and goes off into space. And then this is where we get the whole, the offspring. The Rudy Poot ass of Marlboro, man, that was just the, the baby butter donor. It's like, damn, think about it, bro. You smash and you let a whole chick just go off. With your unborn seed. No plan B, no nothing. I know y'all calling this the off spring, but I'm calling the off ning right there. Like, damn, like imagine does any dude, every dude, just bust all kind of baby batter up in chicks and just send their ass off to space and let the elements or the aliens do the rest. Alien Romance is already telling us about how to be single mothers. Dude busted up inside a Die the Explorer! <laughs> the swiper stopped swiping and he started dropping off dick. I'm still tripping off the fact that the whole offspring scene seems like a damn meat canyon skit. Girl out here feeling her damn slimy breast nectar. Girl out here surprised that she doing the damn Tobey Maguire thing, making her own web fluid. Out here with slime milk. She dead as a slime ball. And Tyrone out here like, oh my gosh, what is that? But out here like, egad. Mammy. Is that you, Mammy? I've been gone for 10 seconds and you are entertaining a new man, Mammy. A new man for a mating ritual, Mammy. How could you? And she out here crying. She's like, what is that? Mammy, how dare you, Mammy? This man's not my father, Mammy. Tyrone is not my daddy. My gosh, this scene right here just screams meat canyon for some reason. Some demented, I come for mother's milk. I come to suck on teats. And look at her. She looking like someone trying to force her to eat some damn Brussels sprouts. Mammy, accept me, Mammy. Love me, Mammy. Mammy, do you love me, Mammy? And just like that, she thought she could curve dudes in the club and she curved her own son. And he was like betting. He curved that damn second tongue in her throat. Started draining her ass of all that slime milk. The whole offspring scene really did not even need to be in this movie. The fact that they even went the extra mile to do this and not make a Dead Space movie is mind-boggling, mind-boggling. Like, the whole scene really could have been avoided. Like, they didn't need to do this. They they dead-ass did it to let us know that they got a budget and that they could actually make a Dead Space movie, that they could actually make a horror space movie thriller that's the only reason that they did this because the whole just this this thing did not make sense whatsoever especially with rain dispatching of this big giant monstrosity and dude smiling and all that you know it's a dude because he has a wiener <laughs> the social justice warriors of the universe won't like what i had to say we had xenomorphs but not necromorphs. And it definitely would have made sense to have this kind of film featuring a dead space element. The fact that we don't even have a dead space movie right now, mind boggling. So it's cool that we get the female empowerment thing, but we don't get no actual legit formula plot already there. Just borrow it and make it into a movie. We got The Last of Us, but we don't have dead space.